All right, over at uh, 15633, um, Lee, Brownstown. <clears throat> Need to get Mr. Mario out for a price. Um, there's quite a bit that would end up needing to be done if we do this house. Uh, there is a good chance we will not do this house, but we just need to check all the same. Um, so the sump pumps aren't working. This one is holding a ton of water. Uh, I think we would need to put concrete around that back edge and finish filling that in. And then the one over here that Jimmy put in, you can see it just filling up. Not really going anywhere here. So that needs to be uh, dealt with. Look at all that water down there. So that needs to be routed up and out somehow. Um, I don't care. Maybe coming up and going into the sewer and out of the house. Um, obviously, it can't be like that for the city inspection. Um, tucking up a bunch of the electrical. Uh, needs new plumbing. Needs a new hot water tank. Probably needs a new furnace. I think the thing's been underwater. I think we can salvage the central air. The floor drains are totally backed up. That has me nervous. The outside foundation walls have a slight bow to them. If we do this for sale, I think we would need to drywall these exterior walls to hide the fact that the foundation has a little bit of a pitch to it. So we'd have to do furring strips all the way up, drywall all this, take out the glass block, maybe put in a better basement heater than what's there right now. Um, and you know, if we do have to put in new central air or a, a new furnace, um, Maybe we can talk to Chris about how much it would cost to take this whole unit, or maybe Mr. Mario can do this, and move it all the way down there so that it vents up and that way, that we would have a nice big open room. That might not be a bad idea. Um, garage. Just needs to be cleaned up real well. Get all the little scraps of wood, get rid of them, get the insulation off the back there. Um, really just a very good cleaning. Backyard, same thing. There's just debris and crap everywhere that needs to be cleaned up. Uh, I'd put a new side entry door on if we do this house. Um, you know, clean all this off, do something with the back deck, do something to cover the underside of that. So we would do a privacy fence between us and the bar. I will get a separate video for kitchen cabinet sizes. If we do this house, we'll be putting in a whole new kitchen, new backsplash, and we'll be doing some kind of floor, new floor. Um, I think we can just stain these cabinets, do a little piece of crown molding across the top, maybe salvage the toilet. That all looks fine. I just put a shower doors on it or a curtain rod. The vanity can probably stay. This I would do carpet, our new paint colors, put a proper light in. Same thing here, carpet, proper paint colors, closet doors, put a light in. Same thing here, build the little bulkhead that it's needed, put a closet rod in, all of that. Um, and what I'm thinking is actually bringing out the privacy fence so that this is enclosed in the privacy fence, maybe coming out a little farther so that you don't have to look at the bar out the side window. <clears throat> and then in the living room, I don't know that these can be sanded and refinished or patched in where they're damaged. So Mr. Mario, you can let me know on that. If not, I think we'll do an engineered hardwood floor here. Um, and then front closet door. Um, that way you walk in and there'll be some kind of hardwood flooring and if we do this house we can go over what to do there. If uh, you have any questions, which I'm sure there will, oh, clean this up and stain it. I think we can save this front door. I don't think it needs to be removed, but 
needs to be weather stripped properly. And there's some little bits of crap. It will need a new storm door. Front porch needs to be cleaned up, stained, all that good stuff. Get rid of the two ugly lights in the front. And uh, yeah, see what we can do.